This afternoon, the body of the man found shot dead yesterday was finally removed from the disused farmhouse in Ahali. The farmer who owns the land noticed yesterday afternoon that the door of the building had been damaged. When he looked in, he saw the dead man lying at the foot of the stairs. It looks as if he was taken here by his captors. His hands were tied behind his back and he was shot in the head inside the house. The area had been cordoned off overnight and army bomb disposal experts were there in case of booby trap devices. The dead man is believed to be Kevin Conway, a Catholic father of four from the Kilwilke estate in Lurgan. Local people described him as a wheeler dealer and he'd been the victim of a so-called punishment attack by the IRA in the past. He was reported missing from his home yesterday afternoon. Police said he was last seen on Tuesday afternoon. The Loyalist Volunteer Force denied involvement and said it was the work of Republicans sorting out an internal problem. Sinn Féin are accusing Loyalists of the murder. Loyalists are prepared to go into Amnesty Stein Road in the heart of Republican West Belfast and patrol that area for up to an hour, it is believed, and shoot taxi man. So they are perfectly capable of coming in here and abducting and murdering a Catholic. We only two weeks ago, uh, Loyalists cruised around the Tignavon housing estate for believed somewhere in the region of 45 minutes before shooting a victim. So it matches the criteria of recent shootings in the area. Uh, the RUC are saying that no one has uh, claimed it, but we've seen Michael McGoldrick's body was left in that area, and young Bernadette Martin was shot in that area. It is a loyalist area. Well, my first reaction is one of great sadness, sympathy to